In this video, let's see how we can access the heat map chart when using a matrix question type. Heat map charts are visually appealing and make reading the data and analysis effortless. They improve the readability and data display, making it easier for you to read the data as you derive insights. We've also added the ability for you to customize colors of the heat map so you can select your brand colors for the display. To get started, go into your survey and click on add question. Here you can select any question type from the basic matrix category. I have already selected a multi-point scale question and set this up. How satisfied are you with the following? product packaging, product quality, and product usability. I'm now going to present this to my audience and collect responses in this manner. Now, once my feedback has come in, to analyze the responses, navigate to analytics and scroll down on your dashboard to find your matrix question. Right here, this is my matrix question. A heat map will be available here by default. You can change the chart type from this toggle button here and select a spider chart or even no chart at all. I'm going to leave the heat map right here. Right next to it, you will find the icon to select your color. You can customize the color as well. Right next to it, you have the option to download this data in Excel or share the link to this report from here. You can also further customize the chart from here, choosing to display or remove the overall column and the percentage. You can also click on customize heat map option to add or remove any of the rows that are in this question. And there we go. This is your heat map for the matrix question type. This feature is available with all our survey licenses and the research license.